Hey, what's happening guys? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, I just want to ask you to go hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up. Appreciate that. So today what we're going to be doing is I'm having a small problem with the LED lights in my sneaker throne boxes that I put in myself. What's been happening is on certain colors, when they're on a certain color for too long, they'll start flashing. So I'm guessing they burnt out the little controller, the little LED controller. So I went ahead and ordered a more robust controller and a driver, the thing that actually powers the controller, from superbrightleds.com. Going to try throwing that in, see if that fixes the problem. So we'll see what happens. And if you guys are trying to do this with sneaker throwing boxes or any type of bigger project with LED strips, if you're using the small crappy strips off like Amazon, first of all, I would suggest to just get the good strips, a 24 volt and the RGB W. They could take more power. They're just a better strip all around. They're definitely more pricey, but worth every penny. But being I have so many already in these boxes, I got to try retrofitting and try figuring something out. So I'm going to just try this controller I got. We'll see what happens. So power wire to the drive unit, to the control unit, to the LEDs. So you got this connected. I'm gonna black tape them. All right, so to go from the driver to the controller unit, I'm gonna use these little connectors right here to go from drive unit to the controller unit. Like that. They soldered the fucking ends. I don't know why they did that. You know, it's not really fitting in the connector. I'm going to cut it and then re-strip them. So we got that wired up. And we just got wired up to the actual LED lights. Okay, so I just temporarily wired this right now to see if everything works. Now let's see what happens. Let's try plugging it in. 
Now, right, here we go. Let's see what happens. Moment of truth. Oh, shit. We got light. I think I might add a second or third channel, the little controller unit. I might add another one of those, but it's all gonna be hooked up to one remote. Because eventually I'm gonna go to the other side with the same setup, and it's definitely gonna need another channel, a few more channels. But until then, thanks for watching, guys. See you later.